Same thing for Monday. So let's say we start in regular De La Hiva, okay? I step over, I come in, he kicks over into reverse De La Hiva. So he's got his leg wrapped around the inside, he's controlling the ankle, he's got his foot on my hip, okay? First thing I want to do is I want to clear the legs, so I'm going to put my butt back and straighten my leg as I push down on both legs, okay? That's when I clear the legs. I come in with my arm inside his leg and I grab lapel control, okay? And lapel control. In no gi, we would just cup the head. So I grab lapel control on both. Now I'm going to straighten this leg and point my knee down and away from me and push that knee down and away as I slide in for the underhook and then I don't overpass. I scoop the leg and come to side control, okay? I can't try to just knee cut through this position. Okay, if I clear the leg and I just try to come straight through it, it's not gonna work, okay? I've gotta straighten the leg and push that knee away. I'm sitting my butt on the inside of his thigh. Super important to get this underhook, or at a minimum, don't let him get the underhook on me, okay? If I'm doing this, this uh, shin slice here and I let him get the underhook on me, I'm just shin slicing to a back take for him. So I either need that underhook or I need to keep my elbow tight and keep his, mat, his back on the mat. Again, we clear, we connect, we pop up, we sit through, underhook, scoop, okay? Same thing we did on Monday. People that weren't here on Monday, I'll walk around and make sure you're doing it right, okay? Let's run it, one, two, three.